always an adventure to go in here because you never know what you're going to find. Yeah, what, what have you found? Probably that I came to work there one day and there was a deer laying in there. That somebody had, uh, that apparently got hit in the road and said, they, they brought it in here and threw it in the compactor. Wow. And they didn't have, and they didn't have a key to get in here, so they couldn't squish it in. So it just lay in there. Did you have? So you must have removed the deer. Oh no. You you kept it in there. Oh yeah. Because yeah. it was by then it was pretty far gone. Right. Yeah, it had been there for a few days or somewhere for a yeah. few days. I know it's been. It's, it's kind of too bad to see something like that, but I guess. it's uh, I don't know there's much difference. What's the difference between that and just plain old household garbage anyway? Wow. The chief of police out here. You guys got your new dumb sticker yet? Yeah. Good. Yeah, we just bought it. <laughs> Good. We just moved here, so. Excellent. But if you can, try to keep an eye on stickers. We're about 150 short this year. <laughs> How can you? How can I see a sticker with his tinted windshield? I know, anyway. I know it's tough. So we'll be stopping in periodically to uh, to just randomly check and just remind people they need yeah, to get them, all right? Good idea. Why don't they I'll let the people buy them on Thursday, for God's sakes? I mean, that's ridiculous. Well, you know what we could probably do is we could go house to house and sell stickers that way yeah, if you want. Sure. I can pick you up. Well, <laughs> I know it don't matter to me whether they do or not. <laughs> Last year we had 160 nine incident reports and about 15 arrests. <laughs> right now, we're halfway through the year, we got 251 incident reports and 40 arrests. Imagine <laughs> that. Why do you think people move to Ashfield? Well, they, I, I, they all say because it's peaceful and quiet and all that stuff. And here, according to the police chief, it's a, just a, I don't know. A sinful town, I guess, according to him. <laughs> I hope that's recorded. I get quite a charge out of, out of people, you know. There's some that look so nice and cheerful and happy and everything, and the next one is a big long face that looks like they hated the whole world. Oh dear. You wonder what they're thinking, a lot of them. Do you think that people's lives make them happy or sad? Or do you think people are just born one way or the other? Oh, well, some people are born, I think, and just always looking on the dark side of everything. And some that are always look on the right side. Of course, here the circumstances, I suppose, do make a, a lot of difference, too. Yeah. What about you, Bud? Are you an optimist? Yes. Yeah? Yep. Yep. Try to be. That's the only way to be, isn't it? There. Done. Done.